welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi welcome I'm Lizette and today guys I want to show you this diamond painting from Diamond Art Club it's a square as you can see over here and also because it's blue because the round diamond paintings of Diamond Art Club have a round circle and this is pink the one that I'm going to be unboxing today is one of the only princesses that is still left on Diamond Art Club from Mandy Manzano and that one is make a wish and take a bite you've got the princess panels and everyone's looking for them but they though that series has stopped so they are no longer available um, you may get them in these stashes but beware of the prices that they are asking for them you see a lot of people doing cross stitch conversions right now and so that just means that you buy the cross stitch pattern and you convert it onto a blank diamond painting canvas um, Lindsay of uh, Emeralds and Fairy Lights is doing a project like that uh, I'll put a link to her channel in the description below but you'll probably already know her um, and the, um, you can buy those patterns on the Etsy shop Creatively Stitching and if you want the canvas and the drills you can buy them well there are a lot of uh, sellers but um, Jade from uh, Jade's Gems shop she sells the canvas so you've got the, the the good size and the drills and her drills are resin so for all the other panels you can go over there but if you want to have a, a canvas ready oh also another thing Lindsay from Emerald Savers like doing a princess along uh, together with Abigail Marie I'll put a link to her channel in the description below as well in June they're doing a princess along so if you want to join that event well maybe this one is one for you because guys okay I've got the old tool kit because this is an older kit right now Diamond Art Club is doing new uh, tool kits as well but this one does the job because in here you have the boat with a funnel, two plates of heart shaped wax, tons and tons of baggies, your diamond painting pen, your tweezers, a squishy that you can put on your pen and a multiplacer, a four placer but what I was saying guys is this is one of the princess panels that is actually still available on Diamond Art Club so you don't need to do a conversion it's just a normal diamond painting the only problem with this canvas that I personally have and I think there will be a lot of people with me I do like the pattern I just don't know about the eyes so what I really like about this canvas is the width it's really easy to work on because that's quite small oh I already like the color of the background but guys okay so inside you've got your step-by-step -step instruction this is the large sticker you see those eyes I think they're a bit spooky but the background is fantastic it's 42 centimeters by 106 as I have said it's a square we have 48 colors and we have only one AB the 141 that's a white and AB is Aurora Borealis and those are drills with a special coating on them I'll show you once we take a look at the drills and these are individual stickers you see that you can use to kit up your containers okay this is the color palette that I actually really like you've got a lot of bright colors but we want to see the canvas and we want to see the eyes and I have an idea of what we can do with the eyes at least I hope 
Okay, right guys, I needed to change the angle because this one is too large to put on my table. Okay, are you ready? Dun, dun, dun. Whoa! <laughs> oh, there's too much glare. <laughs> Sorry. Wow. Okay, I'm going to put you... But look, you can already see this. Okay, I'm going to change the angle again. Oh, wow, guys. <gasps> this, the dress. <gasps> oh, this is really, really pretty. Oh, but the eyes. Oh, <laughs> I really don't like the eyes. I really, really, sorry, I had my hand in front of my mouth. I really don't like the eyes. And I think a lot of people like me are put off by the eyes. But the background, guys, okay, I'm just going to change um, the camera again. Just a sec. So just some basic info. The, the feel of the canvas is really soft and it's scalloped and pierced so that it won't in the left bottom side you've got the thumbnail and the licensing info because it's all legally licensed which means that the artist is getting paid for the work that's being used it's 42 by 106 make a wish take a bite Mandy Manzano Diamond Art Club nice and sticky a really clear drill field but that's always the case with diamond art club you even got a bit of a shimmer on the canvas itself as you can see and you've got a legend in the top left and in the right bottom side and with a canvas of this length that is really practical and then in the top you see oh do what makes you sparkle diamond art club that's the logo of diamond art club and what i do when i work on panels like this is i just you can just roll it up like that then make a small section finish the section and then once this is drilled i'm going to roll it like this with the drills on the outside and just work like that so you've got a really small surface when you're when you're working that's really really great these are very easy panels to work on i think and that's just because this is nice and small so it fits easy on a, on a smaller surface okay right guys look at the bottom all these colors this will be so much fun to do <gasps> wow and then this okay up until here this is i actually prefer this part to um like the fairest of them all the one of snow white that i have already done this is Snow White as well, in case you didn't know. Okay, guys, are you ready? Now we're going to the part that is a bit of a problem. Ooh. <laughs> okay, sorry. We're going to just go, go like this. <clears throat> so this part, <laughs> like, okay, this part again is great. Look at the crown in her hair. And this is really, really beautiful as well. Okay. I can't, all the stained glass in the, in the back. Okay, but this. <laughs> Mandy, I love you, but I don't get the eyes. It really makes it evil. I have even seen questions if this perhaps is the queen. No, this is Snow White. Okay. Snow White, I looked it up, I thought Snow White had blue eyes. Snow White had brown eyes. She had uh, d really dark hair, black hair. She had a really light white skin and hence the name Snow White. 
and she had so a, a very pale complexion maybe that's the better word and she had hazelnut brown eyes well the this is red i'll i'll show you up close I'm really, really, really not a fan of the eyes, as you. <laughs> but the rest of this princess is beautiful and she's still available. So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to change the eyes. And I'm going to make a separate video about that because uh, I'm just going to try things out. Um, that will be up. Uh, it will be my next video that will be up. I, I post videos on Wednesday and on Sunday. I don't know when this one's going to be posted, but if it's on a Sunday, then you know next Wednesday I'll show you the eyes. <laughs> And if it was on a Wednesday, then you know that next Sunday I'll show you the eyes. Okay, let, let's take a look at the drills. Okay, if you've been around my channel, then you know that I'm not going to show you the entire train so i'm not going to call out each number but i am going to show it to you look this is already a great color okay three tens because all the outlining with mandy manzano is in black that's three ten okay let's count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven bags of three ten are you still with me okay then we've got some bl uh, white Red, brown, two large bags. Oh, they are really large bags. So we have one Aurora Borealis. That's this one. Can you see that it had a special coating? Look, that sparkle. Two whole bags. So guys, maybe this will be the first that I can use my three tens that I have. My three tens. My ABs my aurora borealis i have got a lot of aurora borealis drills leftover drills maybe i can use it to bling this one up who knows oh i really like this color 775 it's a really light blue teal kind of color okay and then we've got this you've got all those fun colors guys you see very bright Oh, I really like this one. So apart from the eyes, I really think this will be a great diamond painting to work on. And the great thing about this one is that it's still available with Diamond Art Club. So you don't need to go to the hassle of converting. I'm converting a cross stitch pattern myself, a Josephine wool, <laughs> and it's a challenge. I, I don't think you can compare it to normal diamond painting. Uh, so if you just want to do the act of normal diamond painting and you want to do a princess panel and you haven't gotten one yet, I think this one is a great option. I'll put a link in the description below to the website of DAC so you can check it out and maybe get it for yourself. Um, so next time I'll show you what we can do with the eyes and maybe, hopefully, <laughs> after that you might think, well, I want to get her for myself. But guys, the bodice, this, this is actually really really beautiful i think the this one this part is one of the most beautiful ones from the entire series but it's just the eyes do you agree yeah okay so i'm going to try see what i can do and uh, i'll show you that in the next one if you like this video 
I hope you give me a thumbs up on your way out and if you're new and you haven't subscribed yet and you're still here I hope you'll consider subscribing by hitting that subscribe button and well then next time I put up a video you can see what I'm doing over here. <laughs> right guys thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys!